The only thing that I really have an issue with is the fact that my hair is still kind of short. Yeah. Oh, this is from Urban Outfitters. I know I like these for a reason. These look such good quality anyways. <laughs> I got some cute little things at Marshall's today for $5. Oh, girl. I have deep conditioner in my hair right now. I slept with it in um, two twists in the back and my hair is still like, I'd say about 40% wet. So I'm about to rinse this out. Then we gonna get into this wash and go. So my hair is completely, I don't know if I'm, I'm gonna do a voiceover or not. I just like doing talk throughs. It's so much better to talk as I'm going rather than, I don't know. I just like doing talk through. So I'll probably just do a talk through. Okay, so I am using an OG products. I wanna try, I have not done a wash and go. That's just something that I wanted to tell you guys. I have not done a wash and go in years. Yeah, it's probably been a, a long time. I haven't really, like I've probably done a few wash and goes since my hair is has been short. Um, but I just don't like, my hair is kind of stacked in the back still, so I don't like the way it looks. So this is gonna be the first time that I've done one in a long time, just to simply see how it looks. Probably shape my curls up some. Um, and yeah, so you guys can see, I just trimmed my bangs. So now I'm sectioning my hair off. That was always key for me. This baby off. I don't know when they're clipping it. Um, so I'm literally go, trying to go through old steps in my hair. I don't even like using gel anymore, but I am going through OG steps. I am not using Eco Styler gel. I just cannot find myself, bring myself to do it. Um, so I will use this. I only use this for my edges now. If I do a wash and go, like the last times I was doing wash and goes, I don't use gel throughout my hair anymore. I used to do it just for added hold for a long time so I didn't have to redo my hair. But I don't do it anymore. I normally would just use like a leave-in and a styling pudding or something like that. I really like a one. the one step that I was using was Jane Carter's Incredible Curls. That was what I was using the last time I was doing wash and goes and I was only using that for wash and go. But we got to do OG, OG stuff today. So this is another deep conditioner that I like. I'm almost out of this, so I'm almost out of all my deep conditioners. I also like this brand of Shea Moisture's deep conditioner. This isn't the deep conditioner. This is the twist and defining stuff, but yeah, it's all good. I'm about to get my other clip and then I'll be back. This is the smoothie, but I didn't get it in the jar just simply because I was like, what if I get the whole jar and I don't like it anymore? So, and the last time I used this, I didn't like it. So I was like, I'm rather spend $3.99 on this than go get a whole one for $10 and then be like, I freaking hate it. And they're not taking stuff back. So yeah, let me look at my clip. This is the deep conditioner that I used. This probably is one of my favorites. It's the matcha green tea and wild apple blossom. Oh, it's so good. So I definitely, that I have to go pick that up probably later on today or tomorrow. Um, I went ahead and took my hair out of the other clip. I don't know why. But I just wanted to make sure my hair kind of was lined up throughout the back. All right. So the parting doesn't have to be perfect. And I don't know where my other clips are, so I only have these two. I have a whole lot of these, but I don't know where they went. I got them from, I think. Um, okay, so. Here's the thing, I definitely curl clump. So I'm gonna use a little bit of this throughout each section. 
I'm kind of excited. It smells so good. Ah! Y'all, this was literally my OG. This and the green eco, the green eco styler gel. This was what I used when I first went back natural. Cause I feel like people are like, when I went natural, you've always been natural, but you just covered it up. So when I went, baby, you've went, you went back natural. It's not when you went natural. So I'm taking a little bit of gel. I really don't want a lot cause I just really hate gel now. Like, ugh. But I guess just to kind of see the effects. And I'm just gonna clump. I know I'm gonna have to do some hair shaping. That's why I'm like, let me just do a wash and go. And then we're going out of town this weekend and I have another hairstyle planned for my hair. So that'll probably be like a get ready with me because I don't wanna just swarm my channel with hair stuff. And since when I did wear my hair uh, curly, I stretched it. I kind of stretched it with my diffuser. Not my diffuser, the little concentrator on the blow dryer. That's how I'll stretch my hair. I will never cut my hair again. I don't know why I did it. My hair would be so freaking long right now. Even though I probably wouldn't have let it get long because I cannot stand my long curls. They just kind of look, they don't have any like bounce. They're not super defined my hair type would kind of like with it long it curls like right at the ends but up here it's just kind of like wavy and i don't like that not when it's curled because my hair already kind of does that but when it is longer it just kind of droops even more the longest i like my hair is like to here Now I'm gonna take the gel. This is Wet Line Extreme Gel in a bottle. I prefer in the bottle rather than dipping my hands in the um, Wet Line Extreme Gel. That is so gross feeling that I don't like it. It feels so funny to be adding gel to my hair. I have not done this in forever. Okay. You wanna make sure your hair is saturated and I kinda of feel like this spot isn't. Okay. So far I'm liking this, but back in the day I used it so much, I started to dislike it. It was starting to like kind of clump and just, it just wasn't working good anymore. But right now I'm liking it. I think I might go back. 
I've been looking for some hair products to use. And I think I, Shea Moisture might just be my home girl right now. Cause like I've been using a lot of Shea Moisture here lately. And Um, I've been using a lot of shade moisture. Where is the other one that I use? This one. I'll find stuff at Marshall's and literally I got it for like $6.99. Yeah. So I found this at Marshall's and I use this. And I'm loving, of course, Camille Rose. That's the only other line that I really, really, really like. I like that and I like Eden Body Works. That's it. Which, I don't feel like I'm really out here trying a lot of brand. I tried that Emerge shit. Oh, yo. I'm like, I wish people were making videos on hair products and stuff like they used to. But nobody's really making videos and stuff anymore. That Emerge stuff was freaking terrible. I was so mad. I'm like, why the hell has nobody reviewed this?
You know what I also noticed, y'all? I noticed that this part of my hair is a lot finer than the back. But maybe it's the cut, I don't know. You heard me, bro? Yes, I hear you. Okay, so we're done. We're gonna air dry. We are going to air dry and we'll see how this comes out. I probably will sit under the dryer and on cool just to kind of make it go by faster and then come back and I'll diffuse on camera with my diffuser. Okay, so I am now about to diffuse my hair. Okay guys, so this is my hair. This is how it turned out. And I like I said, I haven't done a wash and go in forever. So I do have some ugly lashes on, so please don't mind those. But this is how my hair looks. Um, I'm really ready for everything to drop. I kind of, like I said, I still kind of have that stack from the way my short, my um, pixie cut was, but overall i really like it um and again if you didn't watch the whole thing i used the curl enhancing smoothie and this small i'm still glad i have a little bit more probably have like another use out of this i can get another use maybe use it for myself or my daughter and then i use the wetline extreme gel except instead of eco styler because i'm just not with eco styler i feel like it is so super drying on my hair so i don't use that anymore haven't used it in probably like years i only use wetline extreme gel and i only use that for my edges but today i decided to do it like um today i decided to do it do my old wash and go routine so i had to use gel throughout my hair and i really like it i'm kind of glad that i have a lasting style for the for the next three to four days because I have been super extra with my hair. I've definitely been doing different protective styles. And I do plan on doing one this week. Simply because my daughter starts virtual school. And we're going to be busy. So I want to look good. Um, rather than have to get up every morning and pull my hair in a bun. or Yeah. So. This is my hair. Let's get a little bit into it. You guys know I love frizz. I just got back from my mom's house. So I let I blow dried my hair. Oh no, I sat in the dryer for a little bit, let it set. Blow dried it with the diffuser. Then kind of went in with the concentrator and kind of stretched a little bit. Then went to my mom's house, kind of let it get a little bit bigger. Tomorrow is going to be even better. Um, I do feel like I need more shape. Um, yesterday I was cutting... The front pieces of my hair not realizing that i was cutting a bang because you know when you cut curly hair wet you don't know what it's gonna look like once it shrinks up so that's just a little tip um yeah i'm glad i didn't go up any shorter because i was um so i have a little bang but it's all right i like it now I need to try to get some pictures for this thumbnail. Um, before this light goes out. Because today is my mom's birthday, August 11th. 
and we went over to her house to sing happy birthday and stuff and yeah so we're trying to beat i'm trying to beat the sun so anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video um please don't forget to comment rate subscribe and hit that bell notification so you can be notified every single time i upload i don't have a set schedule yet i'm trying to get the feel for what i feel like works for me before i give you guys a set schedule um of when i upload but yeah i will see you guys in the next one bye